I will just say this. This is the most, most animals I've ever had. We've got it loaded down. Hey guys, Dusty Baker of Cross Timbers Bison. Welcome back to the channel. We are hitting the road today, going south of the Red River. Notice I got the rig on the truck ready to go. Got a surprise for you guys. Hope you enjoy it. Let's go. All right, typically, they would hit you. We got to stick, we'll have to stick our hands in here to pop this. Okay. Or unless sometimes I can get it. Maya and I made the big journey south. Made it back to southern Oklahoma. What a long day. Left the original farm where my first herd uh, is at 8 o'clock this morning with an empty trailer. 6 o'clock in the evening over at the new ranch with a full trailer. And let me tell you, when I say full, wait till you see the very first animals that are ever gonna be first bison to ever be on this ranch uh, are right here in this trailer and i'm super ex i'm super excited uh to share this with you guys uh kevin's gonna come over and help me unload them my wife will be here but uh so pretty excited about that right here just a long day actually everything went smooth um picking them up the guys had them corralled they actually had them in a trailer ready to go and uh we did some moving around but basically we got them transferred over to my trailer and uh everything's good so uh long journey back but uh finally made it i will just say this this is the most most animals i've ever had in here so we've got it loaded down okay hope you guys are ready let's pull up here open the gate and let them out Coming your way. Come on, cows. How many you got in the front? 
four. Huh? Oh, yeah. As you can tell, this place hasn't had any attention in a long time. A lot of recovery time. That's why I can barely even see them. I know you hear cattle, but those aren't cattle. Sounds like somebody's feeding. Well, they're all here still today. Been eating hay. Look at that calf. <laughs> He's still munching away. So, got Brooksy out here with me, and uh, we're just checking on the herd that we purchased yesterday. And last night, Kevin helped me get them unloaded and make sure all of the gates were tied up and secure we had some water issues i remember this is the new place but uh luckily we got it all straightened out and we got them some water and uh they're taken care of so it looks like they found it but uh these animals are pretty calm and uh that was one of the reasons uh when you when you go and look at animals you want to make sure that they're not too wild and crazy so these guys are pretty calm and they handled everything pretty well actually they did a good job and uh, so they let us come up here and check them out and as you can tell probably let's take a look at these bison you can see that they uh, they definitely need some attention uh, they need some they need some groceries is what Kevin would say <laughs> they need some groceries huh? what is it they need some food um, and uh, they need some treatments and some vaccinations as well See the calves? Hear those cows? Those cows are getting fed, I think. Already trying to figure out Ty. <laughs> if you guys have never met Ty, this is our wiener dog, Ty. He's 15 years old.
There's the oldest bull. Supposedly he's from the Dakotas. Well, hey guys, thank you for watching today's video. Uh, I hope you're excited as much as I am with the Texas 16. Um, that is just another set of animals that we can help grow this thing. And it starts right here on this property. But I've got some exciting things uh, for you coming. Um, and one thing I do want to do is, is every time we show a video at the new ranch here, I want to show you and feature some of the things around the place so i can kind of slowly introduce those things to you um, instead of showing it all to you at once i want to show you some things about the property um, you know part of the barn uh, the handling facility that is here and just some cool features part of the the land i also want to show you guys something that my wife and i have been working on for a long time and i've loved this since i was a kid i used to sell it when i was a kid at school uh, it was deer at the time but um something we've been working really hard on and i'm very excited to bring to you right here from sulfur oklahoma we've got our own jerky line guys and sticks guys we've got sticks right here and our very own jerky right here you got a 2.5 ounce jerky pack gonna leave you with that guys go check us out at crossdenversbison.com thank you